now we continue the subject chemistry chemistry deals with substance now there should be a clarification of matter and substance anything we see around us which is which has got mass and has the capacity to occupy space means it occupies space it has mass and can be perceived by our physical senses we call it as a matter but substance actually is what is made up of one kind of atom or one kind of molecule yeah different kinds of atom combined in a fixed ratio that is a substance and chemistry deals with substance the pure and homogeneous material that is having same composition the properties throughout the mass this is homogeneous and it is made up of either one kind of atom or molecules or different kinds of matter different kinds of atom combined in a fixed ratio this first one we call the element element is made up of one kind of atom only yeah one kind of molecule and second one we call the compound and this is substance has got two different types <coughs> elements and compounds now we come to come across two different words atoms and molecules atoms come here the smallest particle of the substance which can may or may not exist independently but takes but take part in chemical reaction we call it atom atom is characterized by the reaction atoms react in higher classes this reaction you will be having the two reactions one is the orbital reaction which is taking place in the electron part of the atom around the nucleus 
and other is a nuclear reaction normally higher physics you will be doing it yeah higher chemistry will be doing it that is nuclear fission nuclear fusion where it is the subatomic particles nucleons are increased in numbers or they reduced in number they are reduced in number so this smallest particle of the substance that may or may not exist independently but take part in chemical reaction alcohol atoms molecules are the also the same thing molecules are also smallest particle that exist independently that exist independently and exhibit all the properties of the substance we call it molecule they does not take part in chemical reaction but it is said that atoms composed to form molecule molecules are made up of atoms atoms are the level atoms are the particles which take part in chemical reaction not the molecule molecule represent the substance molecule show the characteristic features of the substance so these are the atoms and molecules we have got the new words here now chemistry started way back in between in 8th to 16th century a new group of scientists came they called they were known as alchemist this was the branch of chemistry alchemy alchemy it is not only scientific means science is there plus spiritual thoughts are also there alchemist they dealt in science with mixed with spiritual thoughts and they were in search of two special thing one is philosopher stone what they are supposed to do other is a fragrant liquid they call elixir and that elixir was it's an imaginary liquid that was to cure all the diseases or what do you call means if you just put that thing on the substance that that thing will give you a spiritual status that will give the substance to a spiritual a spiritual status by which you will be surviving for a long time even you may be immortal so this was the that's the thought so they were supposed to have a philosopher stone this what was the concept touching any cheaper metal to change it to gold they thought there will be some cheaper that there will be some liquid a paste a waxy thing that philosopher stone they call it that philosopher stone is to take on the cheaper metal and cheaper metal will change into gold
sorry this is I philosopher stone this touches any cheaper metal and that changes to gold that was the concept on the other hand they were searching for a liquid this was used that time in medicine they used to say that that will stop aging of the person so the person will never get old